Once upon a time, in Inkwell Isle, Cuphead, Mugman, and their new friend Ms. Chalice decided to throw a crazy house party while Elder Kettle was visiting Los Angeles. The trio wanted to have some fun and let loose, so they invited all their fellow animated friends to join in on the festivities. As the night grew darker, around 2 a.m., Greta Van Fleet arrived and decided to blast their iconic song, Highway Tune, very loudly. The whole neighborhood could feel the vibrations of the rock and roll anthem. However, in the midst of the party madness, a crazy Karen who lived nearby, disturbed by the loud music, decided to call the police. As soon as everyone realized what was happening, panic spread through the party like wildfire. People began scrambling to find hiding spots and scattered in different directions to avoid any legal trouble. Days later, after the chaotic party had ended, Elder Kettle returned home. When he saw the total wreck that the house had become, he became incredibly angry. In a fit of rage, Elder Kettle tapped into an unexpected power and went Super Saiyan, wreaking havoc in the house with his newfound strength. Just as things seemed to get even more out of control, Ariana Grande, attracted by the commotion, walked into the scene. Astonished by Elder Kettle's new and formidable form, she let out a scream in surprise. Meanwhile, in the midst of the chaos, Billie Eilish, tired from the late-night events, yelled from the bathroom, Keep it down. I'm trying to sleep in the bathtub. The sheer absurdity of the situation caused a momentary silence as everyone turned to look at her in confusion and amusement. Feeling the weight of the situation and the scolding from Ariana Grande and Billie Eilish, Elder Kettle realized the error of his actions. He immediately reverted back to his normal self, apologizing profusely for the mess and destruction he had caused. With everyone gradually calming down, Cuphead, Mugman, Ms. Chalice, Ariana Grande, and Billie Eilish worked together to clean up the party aftermath. They turned the wreckage into a full-blown renovation project, transforming the house into an even more spectacular abode, ensuring it was ready for the next wild celebration. And from that day on, the inhabitants of Inkwell Isle learned the importance of partying responsibly, and the legends of that unforgettable house party lived on, becoming a cautionary tale and a source of laughter for generations to come.